week leading into round four. Played in the Magpies the week before on Thursday night against uh, Norwood at the parade. Following week, trained um, with Tuesday, Wednesday, and had hidden heroes that morning. And um, Dan Houston was pre presenting it. With um, the hidden hero jumper and also another jumper with that. You know what that might be, Jamie. <laughs> 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 Mate, it's, uh, it's exciting for us to see you come into the club, do what you've done in the early days. And good luck on Friday and what a night against the Tigers first day. We'll never forget the day, 9th of April. Turned 19 that day, so Friday night, Adelaide Oval, pretty nerve wracking day. Made sure I did everything right. Gave my, wanted to give myself the best chance to be able to play as well as I could. Go out there and be you tonight, mate. Smash a few bodies. Enjoy. Yeah. It was a bit surreal coming out into the field to warm up. You know, you'd be standing in the goals kicking out and stuff and you can hear people and it was, yeah, it was a different feeling to hear people like calling out your name. BT, that noise that you just heard was for the debutante, Lockie Jones. So I started on the bench for the game and then run on and that was pretty loud. Is there, have you seen a more Port Adelaide looking young man than Lockie Jones? Look at that for a mullet. What are you saying, JB? And got the real Mustaka rolling as well, I love it. Yeah, that first time I ran on and ran straight up to Dusty and it was, yeah, pretty chaotic. I remember my first touch, got a handball from Dersmer and, and kicked it down the line and you could hear the crowd again. Gives it off to Jones with his first touch. It's something I've never experienced before, it gave me chills, you know, goosebumps all over me. So, And our, every game after that at home was the same, but the first one was just different to experience it first hand. Just carried him. Oh, Jones, the first gamer, if you don't mind. If they weren't in love, they are now, the Port fans. Look at him here. They actually took the last kick of the game too. Port Adelaide are going to win the game. They've got it wrapped up. I just booted on my left foot straight up in the air. Jones, the first game and may have had the last kick. Got up by two in the end. Yeah, it's something I'll never forget. As the siren went, it was just a sigh of relief and then a um, couple of seconds just to realise what had just happened. So, yeah, pretty unreal feeling. Jones, they love him. You can tell. They've fallen in love with the hair. They just like it.